Wow, 80 years. You've had a hell of a ride, Carol. And I have been very fortunate to join you on that ride for the last three-fourths of it. Loved you then, loved you just as much today. Happy birthday, honey. I remember a time in my 30s when mom and I were at Westport at the ocean. We were down on the beach walking along and um, I really relied on my mom heavily at that point, um, being a new mother. Um, she always gave me the best advice and um, she commented about the penguins flying along the waves. And my first thought was, I didn't know we have penguins in Washington. And my second thought was, and I didn't know penguins could fly. But before I questioned what she was saying, because she always gave such great advice, those were my first thoughts. So anyway, Mom, I still respect your intelligence, and um, I like to watch the pelicans fly on the water. Happy 80th. I love you. Hi, Carol. Wishing you a happy 80th birthday. Can you believe you were... 37 years old when I popped into this uh, group. I'm glad to have been able to share these last 44 years with you as my mother-in-law. Looking forward to this party and hope you enjoy your time with your family. Happy 80th, Nana. Looking forward to celebrating with you. I love you from your oldest and best grandson. Happy. Say Nana. Nana. Happy. Baby. Happy. This is Nana. Happy birthday, Nana. We wish we were there celebrating with you. And also just wanted to say that when everyone thought I was crazy for liking mustard, honey, and pickle sandwiches, uh, you just let me eat them and they were delicious. <laughs> Thank you. It's a good memory. Happy birthday, Nana. I love you. Love Mom. you. Bye. Hope you have a great 80th birthday. And I love you so much, my best and toughest Scrabble opponent. <laughs> love you, Mom. Well, happy birthday, Carol. And um, it was a special request from one special lady to another, Donna. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dearest Carol. Happy birthday to you. Still got it. Happy birthday. We're so excited to get to celebrate with you such a big milestone. Hope you have a really good birthday. We're really excited for the party. And we love you. Happy birthday! It's been an honor being your grandson for these past 28 years. Between, you know, spending the night at the Issaquah house and getting my butt kicked at Scrabble. Um, and I look forward to many more. Happy birthday, Nana. Thanks for being the best grandmother that it's anyone could ask for. And thanks for uh, being like a grandmother to Abby as well. I'm so. happy to have joined this clan. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Nana. 80 years is such an accomplishment. You know, I was thinking about how you have always made all of your grandchildren feel so special and important from making us cozies to taking us to the beach at Westport. So I hope that today you get to feel just as important and special as you have always made all of us feel. Happy birthday. Love you. Hi, Mom. Happy birthday. 
besides the fact that you are smart and wise and kind, generous, caring, loving, beautiful, funny, um, I really appreciate the way that you have always been there for us, um, just always there to listen to anything that we want to talk about, about kids, about sports, about the Cougs, trips, family, work. <laughs> you just listen, and that was really, really special. Um, also, speaking of being there for us, you were always there for us when we were kids, and just having a stay-at-home mom was awesome, and that you know, really inspired me from the time I was a little kid to also want to be a stay-at-home mom. Granted, I work from home, but I'm still there for my kids. Um, and you really inspired me to do that. So I want to say thank you and happy birthday. We love you very, very much. Happy 8th birthday, Carol. Thank you for all your support you've given me and Deb and our whole family over the years. Uh, your positivity and interest in our family's endeavors over the years has been great. Again, happy birthday. Hey, Nana, I just want to wish you a happy birthday. I just want to thank you for all the things that you do for me and the rest of the family and um, everyone else that's here. So, yeah, I want to thank you for, you know, letting me stay the night at your place when my parents are out of town sometimes or even homework assignments um, and projects that, you know, my parents can't help me with or something like that. So, yeah, I just want to thank you. I really appreciate you. Hopefully you have a great birthday. Happy birthday. Hi, Nana. Happy birthday. Um, I just want to tell you how grateful I am for you and how thankful I am that you're my grandma. Um, oh, uh, I remember growing up when we all would go camping. Uh, I remember sitting in your trailer and learning so many games and I think we played, I think we played Yahtzee and Batgammon maybe and lots of card games and board games. But um, those were all really good, fun memories. And yeah, thank you. Love you. Bye. Hi, Nana. Happy birthday. I just want to tell you how grateful I am to be your granddaughter because no matter the situation, you make it really fun and interesting. And you always are making kind gestures for me and my family and especially me and my siblings because you always um, are making food for us or always having crystal light. And I really enjoy playing games with you, even though you do beat me like a lot of the time. But I'm just really thankful to be your granddaughter. Happy birthday. I love you. Hi, Mom. Being the daughter who has carried on the torch of hosting Thanksgiving, I thought it would be fitting to share a story about Thanksgiving. So first, I did always like that we sang the Edelweiss prayer with lyrics that you wrote about family and love and being grateful. And I especially remember one Thanksgiving where just as we were sitting down to dinner, the power went out and we ate dinner by candlelight. And after later that night, you said that that was the best Thanksgiving you ever had because it was all about enjoying each other and really focusing on what's truly important, which is family. And you've continually shown that love to all your children and grandchildren and really everyone around you in more ways, mom, than you'll ever know. And we're so blessed that we get to keep feeling your love even after 80 years. So happy birthday. I love you. Happy birthday, Carol. Congratulations on 80 years. You've definitely earned a relaxing, enjoyable day today. Happy 80th. Happy birthday, Nana. I really appreciate you so much. I love you. You're so kind and easy to talk to. And I really appreciate everything you've done for me my whole life growing up and everything you've done for my brothers as well. I love you so much. Hi, Nana. Sorry I couldn't make the party, but happy 80th birthday. Love you. I Tobin, Nana, I Tobin. I love you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Nana. One of the best memories that I had was at your old house and just walking down to the creek, just playing with uh, Jade and Kai Hunter. And feeding the horses was also really cool. And uh, the grape tomatoes you guys used to grow were also amazing. Um, anyways, love you. Aloha from Maui. Many of you have heard this story before, but I'm going to tell it anyway. 
everyone talks about how sweet and kind and thoughtful and family-loving Carol is, but I think this story really sums up who she is and who many of us would like to be. On a trip in the 80s, returning from a visit to the kids in Bozeman, we stopped at a rest area in Idaho or Montana, and off in the distance there was a tribal powwow going on from many tribes around the West. And an Indian came up to our car and said, oh, I'm also from Washington. I'm, I'm a Yakima. Uh, could you give me a handout? At which point I was ready to dismiss him. And Carol says, you wait right here. And she went into the tent trailer and came out with a handmade sandwich, an apple, and a can of pop, and handed it to the man and said, God be with you. And that's the end of the story. And that sums up who my lovely bride is. Let your love get to me. Ten pipers piping. Nine ladies dancing. Eight maids are milking. Seven um, swans are swimming. Seven swans are singing. Five birds. Four calling birds. Three French hens. Ooh, charcoal dog. And a fire fish and a fire fish.